Hello everyone, my name is Kaichiro and today I'll show you how to create a pencil sketch effect in DaVinci Resolve. So I'm in a fusion comp and I have my footage here, as you can see. And first thing I'm gonna do is add a merge node from uh, this bar here, so I'm drag it in. Then I'm gonna add direct to background nodes and, and I'm gonna make one of the background nodes white, like this. And then I'm gonna plug the white background into the yellow input of the merge and the black background into the green input. And then I'm gonna add a bitmap node by shift space and type in the bitmap and plug the bitmap into the blue input of the merge and in the bitmap set the channel to luminance and plug your media into the bitmap and then if you look at it you can see this is what it's gonna do so so after the media in I'm gonna add a edge text type in an edge text and as you can see this is like kind of like a pencil thing almost so now we're just gonna add the imperfections to it I'm gonna set the smooth to zero, the brightness all the way up, and the denoise also to zero. Also, make sure it's set to grayscale edges. And after the edge attacks, you can add a brightness and contrast node. And you can use these low and high sliders as like a threshold slider. So I'm gonna do something like this maybe, and make sure you uh, turn on these checkboxes to and clipping and after that I'm gonna add a merge node and a fast noise and plug the fast noise into the green input of the merge and in the merge set the apply modes to not apply and uh, in the fast noise in the color tab make sure the first color is the alpha value all, way, all the way to one and in the fast noise you can Increase the scale and increase the detail and the contrast a bit. Also, just see if it a bit, just see, play around with the controls to see what you like. And what we're doing right now is basically uh, adding some imperfections and some, as if some parts of the drawing have been erased. And after that, I'm gonna add another merge node and I'm gonna also set to multiply in the apply mode and then I'm gonna add a background node set it to gradient here and I'm gonna set the start of the X to 0.5 and after that let's actually take a look at it after that I'm gonna add a transform node and uncheck the U size and aspect and set the X size to a very very low amount like 0 0.005 and then set the edges to wrap and if you plug it into the merge now you can see that uh, you get these lines and I'm gonna also angle it a bit so it looks better and yeah, that's how you get this like uh, pencil effect. And after that, I'm gonna add one more merge um, and another fast noise, and set it to multiply again in the merge. And the uh, fast noise in the green input of the merge, and do the same thing. And set the color to the alpha of the color to one. And in this fast noise, uh, we're gonna set the scale to a very high amount, like uh, 300 or something. And detail also all the way up. And you can play around with the brightness and contrast. And this adds like very, very little uh, more imperfections on a smaller scale. And to push this further, you can add a displace node and plug the best noise into the displays set the type to x and y and just slightly shift these uh, the x refraction and the y refraction just a little bit and as you can see it's kind of hard to tell what's going on so after that you're gonna add a 
uh, brightness contrast node again and it's increased the gamma so you can see it better as you can see this displays that's like these uh displaces the the lines and makes it a bit rougher like a real pencil and yeah i'm gonna not so much something like this and that's basically it for the effect uh some things i like to do is add a, a lower the frame rate with like a posterized time and like low like four it's uh it's more with a hand-drawn effect and the notes, brightness contrast notes you can and decrease it if you want to like erase it more make it look more worn and old like an older drawing or like a newer drawing like this and yeah that's it uh, basically for the effect so thanks for watching and bye bye